Mataji, tip 14. The last word of the six words is retraining. Retraining of the mind. The practice that was so successful for Siddhartha was basically a Samatha and Vipassana practice with the two components of serenity and insight yoked evenly together as mentioned in Majjhima Nikaya number 149 section 10. Now the retraining part of the mind how does one retrain one's mind? We have to look today to modern science in cognitive psychology and neurocognitive science. What we're finding is research and the research on how the brain operates in the human being is being studied very, very closely. What they have discovered about brains is very exciting. And this is because the results of this research tell us anyone can learn to change. This opens the door to peacemaking. Peacemaking amongst ourselves, in our families, sisters, brothers, parents, children, neighbors, towns, cities, countries, everything. It opens the way to understanding that human beings actually can change if they have the proper information about the past and the future and the present time. We must all remember the past is just a few moments ago, not many years or many lifetimes ago only. This lesson is about letting things go that have moved into the past and attempting for the survival of the group to look closely, more closely, at the present time. The present time is what is so very important. The present moment is a fad, is something fun to say, but none of us can stay in a present moment. However, when we apply things to our life, we can stay in the present time of what we are doing at any given situation. This is what we need to learn. The past is history. And then the future is a mystery. So worrying about the future and what will happen constantly in the present time will suck the energy away from the person, away from the mind, the brain, for today's energy. For today's energy is all we truly have. And we must apply today's energy, one cup for each day, very carefully to do our chores, our work at school, our project, our report, our preparation for a presentation, to work on one patient at a time if we are helping with COVID, one issue at a time if we are in a family, one project at a time if we are in a community. We must all work together at this time. One of the most difficult things is worrying about the future and the weight that that puts on the person and takes away their energy. The other end is the past, nagging with fears of what might happen again or could happen again or what what did happen in the past and too much thinking takes our energy away again. Move to the next clip. 